most of the things, <laughs> apart from the spiritual process that I did, I never went through any training. I simply went and did it like I know it and it always worked. To say things that people believe you cannot do. You know, there was a time when I was always on two wheels, four wheels, I looked at it with great disdain. I would never get into a car. If even if somebody asked me to come in their car, I said, no, tell me where I'll come on my motorcycle. Because getting into a four-wheeled vehicle was considered, I will do it when I'm on eighty-five. <laughs> so, it was just beyond me, I could not get into a car. I said, I'm not going to get into a car. So once it happened that uh, we were driving to a wildlife sanctuary and uh, I was on my motorcycle and this girl was driving this car with another four people and none of those four people could drive and this girl got very sick and she got terrified because it's a wildlife sanctuary, she cannot drive. Then they don't know what to do. They, she says, I can't drive, I'm so too tired, I'm not feeling comfortable with all this forest, I cannot drive. And then I said, there was no other way, otherwise we have to wait and turn back. Then I said, okay, and I parked my motorcycle. I said, okay, I'll drive. I had never driven a car till that point. But uh, right from my childhood, whether it's a bus or a car or whatever anybody is driving, I paid attention as to how it happens. I just sat down and drove ninety kilometers on a narrow track, narrow tarmac track to from, you know, like uh, to Nagarhole, which is a very… which was a very narrow track at that time. I drove all the way and I parked the car there. Then I said, this is the first time I drove and never drove <laughs> and it's not as bad as I thought. I thought driving a car is for cripples. <laughs> I thought motorcycle is a real thing, car is for crippled people. It's like for handicapped people who can… cannot balance on two wheels <laughs> I said, it's not so bad. And they said, what, you never driven? I said, no, this is the first time I drove. How can you drive? Why can't I drive? I've seen people driving. Almost everything I've done is like this. I've never been to any training of any kind. It just takes a little attention. Every human being can do this, but they have a backlog in their head. <laughs> They're carrying so many things of how it cannot happen.